हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम और वेलकम बैक टू टी कप डारो माय नेम इज़ रेया एंड इन टुडेज वीडियो वी आर गॉन बी टेकिंग अ लुक एट व्हाट मैसेजेस यू नीड टू रिसीव फ्रॉम आर्क एंजल माइकल ओके नाउ बेसिकली दिस इज अ टाइमलेस वीडियो सो वेन यू कम बैक एंड लिसन टू अ पाइल इट इज गॉन बी फॉर यू yeah having said that three pals in front of you please make sure to select one that is most for you and once you're done with that we start with pile 1 hello and if you've selected pile 1 then these are the messages that you need to receive from archangel michael let's begin with your messages pile 1 all right so basically when it comes to you Archangel Michael is here to tell you that when it comes to your life, you know, you are born as a golden child. So since you are born as a golden child, you are born with certain rare gifts. But for this gift to come to light, there has to be a particular timing, and that timing is very very close. Okay. So when it comes to your life right now, preserve your tenderness, preserve that essence of you that is different, that is beautiful. because it is those qualities in you that are different that are unique and innocent will take you to where you want to be okay so don't ever let go of that inner child of yours or that innocence or sincereness when it comes to you because that is what will take you the long way when it comes to your life now archangel michael is also here to tell you that at this point of time you know you need to make your life into a new moving prayer and it basically means you know everything you do it has to be an act of devotion if you do something for somebody do it as you are doing it for god and that will sort of give you the results that you cannot even begin to imagine when it comes to your life so simple you know if you can as you walk go through your day start reciting some kind of mantra you know that mantra will then become a part of you and that will help you when it comes to your process when it comes to life because that will make you into a moving prayer and see when a person becomes a moving prayer then their wishes come true and the wishes that they hold for others they also come true yeah that is what is being said to you because your heart is going to be converted into almost like the best version of itself is what is coming through now once again let me just tell you this when it comes to anything that you desire right now okay you've had a goal for a very long time it is coming true very very quickly so don't deviate from your path is a message coming through yeah you will know what is the ideal course of action to take yeah so when you decide that this is the course of action that i need to take stick with it because if you stick with things then the destination is very very close for you yeah and you're very celebrated already once again with the illumination you got to be having some aha moment where you realize that okay you know this is what it was that i required yeah so it is almost like you know everything that you were working for up to this moment there is going to be one point where you get the key for something and you realize it yeah that is what is happening for you remember this because you are a golden child yourself you were already born with certain gifts so your job on planet earth is to share those gifts with other people by just being you by sharing knowledge to the world or by helping others through spiritual teaching so when you having a normal conversation and if you feel like you know okay this person needs this guidance then because of your knowledge you share that guidance with this person and this person gets the solution to their problems so that is a role that you entrusted with in this lifetime almost the role of a high priestess yeah that's coming through however to get the role of the high priestess and to you know finally realize your gifts in life right now the process is you know you're tied up in certain chains and those chains with time will get released and once those chain gets released you will be beginning the process of healing and once the process of healing begins you will easily be diverted towards that ideal course of action and you will have whatever it needs yeah please make sure to spend time reflecting so if you are the kind of people who are constantly in movement please rest at least for 10 minutes every day do nothing sit with a cup of tea sit with a cup of coffee or just sit chanting a mantra 
and after you're done chanting a mantra close your eyes and pray yeah and just to witness that silence that comes after that that is true reflection and with that reflection you will gain what you're supposed to when it comes to your life now see what is happening you know your life is expanding into newer territories into territories you did not even think was possible for you see and when a person is about to break certain barriers things seem difficult in the beginning but as you come into a habit of doing things whether it is when it comes to your material life your studies or spiritual life once something becomes a pattern a habit for you it becomes easier and then the barriers will break for you yeah that's coming through now when it comes to your relationships you know archangel michael is here to tell you demonstrate love show the people in your life that you care about them that you love them in fact because you know you may have the greatest amount of love for somebody but unless you do something to prove it that love is never like out in the open so how to display love can be done by multiple things by being sincere in your belief and by making sure you constantly give love to the person by doing acts of service towards them whatever it is that means demonstrating love to you because that will help you when it comes to your life so find out what is important to the people you care about and do more of that now one thing however you need to remember please exercise moderation moderation of eating moderation of speaking especially and moderation when it comes to sleeping as well because right now you know the energies around you are such that excess of something can take you right back into the chains okay so minimize certain things and exercise moderation so that way everything that is not in alignment right now will come back into alignment especially when it comes to health okay now see we all know the way in which the divine guides us now divine can sometimes guide us through a book okay we have holy books across religions or it could be prayers whatever it is you need to select that this is what i need to do and you need to be constant in that direction because when you make that belief a constant source of guidance for you then you will almost have a fixed start to follow so if you are the kind of people you have a tendency of picking up one mantra leaving it and picking up another one don't do that stick to one yeah make sure you chant it like a lakhs of times because it is then when you will get to realize that true power of that particular mantra so if you're reading a book a spiritual book a religious book for that matter the quran gita bible whatever it is stick to reading it and stick with it because the kind of guidance you get it will be mind blowing for you and your path in life will become very very easy that is coming forth for you yeah uh, once again please understand this that you have been thinking in a stack static manner yeah it's almost like okay you always been doing certain things and they have become a pattern for you so when it comes to your work area especially okay deviate from the pattern do something in an innovative fashion because innovation will help you in a lot of ways i'm not asking you to change your path just change your methods of doing things so if you have an exam and if you were studying in the evening study in the morning it may change a couple of things for you yeah that way so when it comes to your life you know innovative thinking and innovative methods will help you a great deal all right let's see a goal oriented person so once again to begin with you need to have certain goals like i need to do this much by this date okay so if you become a goal oriented person i feel like your task will become much more easier and you'll be able to hit your milestones easily yeah you'll reach your goal very very quickly a meeting with a stranger could be very important so somebody that you don't know of yet when you're watching this video you meet this person and you see that this person has turned out really helpful for you yeah so that meeting with a stranger is very important and there also might be some kind of announcement for you and remember this when it comes to this person i feel like archangel michael will send this person into your life okay because that's what i'm hearing yeah of course there's going to be some kind of announcement use your intuition so once again archangel michael is here to tell you your intuition guides you 
don't neglect your guidance especially when it comes to your reading things from religious book if you've been feeling like okay you know i need to get back to this get back to it that will really really help you family wishes coming true okay so something that your family wanted for you it's going to happen and it's going to happen very very soon climbing towards success so when it comes to your life you know you are on the right track once again and you are slowly but surely climbing towards success new home new attitude okay now for a couple of you there is a possibility that you know you may travel a change of residence is likely or redoing your house in some ways is also there of course for some of you this could be you know spring cleaning your house or just cleaning in some ways that is also there a journey either physical or mental will leave you wiser so this is a journey that you're going to be undertaking of course if you are like moving then of course this is a journey to a new house or a new place a vacation a uh, dealing or relationship with an older man is going to be important baba stack you can continue to take it as messages from archangel michael or baba depending on you mother earth now if you are going through certain difficulties serve mother earth animals plants birds whichever way it is okay so you will get the good karma meditation that's exactly what i was telling you you know after you finish meditating like after you finish repeating a mantra meditate that will really really help you so okay so basically the grace of sai is in your life okay now you can also like take this as archangel metatron's presence your life is really really strong yeah and with the grace on you there are going to be no mistakes if you are going to be making any mistakes you'll be taken away from it and this going to be something that you're going to be celebrating but celebrations are in order yeah but overall these are the messages that you need to receive from archangel michael and as i wrap this up i want to leave you with my best wishes i will see you next time bye Hello, and if you selected pile two, then these are the messages that you need to receive from Archangel Michael. Let's take a look. Oh, look at that! You guys match. <laughs> Let's begin. All right. So basically, for you pile two, you may feel like you know things are slightly difficult for you, but you just need to surrender to whatever is happening because there's a reason why things are being made that difficulties. right now wherever you are it is like you know you are at the peak of resolving your karma because once this story is over once this part of your life is over you will never ever look back at it in a way you know this was also to test your strength yeah what metal you made up of that is what is coming through now archangel michael is also here to tell you that in the process of your life you are not alone there are so many people there to guide you to support you through the process of life now for some of you you know these could be people who don't live in the same place as you do like they could almost be you know all over the world is what i'm hearing right now but just know this that doesn't matter where your people are they can almost feel things the things that are happening to you the things that are happening when it comes to life and instinctively they know that this person needs help so they are giving you help even before you feel like you know you need to ask for it yeah that's coming through so you're very safe in a way protected by your star family however pile 2 you're being told don't give up on hope and don't give up on the belief that happiness is reachable but it comes with hope yeah hope in the higher power hope in all of the spiritual beings so don't quit and don't give up that hope yeah see it's usually you know after the darkest night that is sun rises that is what is happening when it comes to you guys that is what i'm seeing here yeah however please remember this you need to be slightly diligent on your own yeah see when you feel like you know things are getting a bit too much then move away from things yeah take a break do something that feels easy So if in your work you're finding things are becoming very difficult move away for it for some time do something that feels more light more fun and once the crowd departs you can come back to it so that you know things can get resolved much more easily so don't try to fight things is what is coming through for you now once again please remember to be receptive 
help is coming in your direction so take that help is a message coming forth see because you know when you allow that receptivity you happen you bring in the greatest blessings when it comes to life and you are likely the kind of people who always give but if you are going to be the giver all the time then you're going to be depleting your sources so learn to receive is the message coming through as well now once again this is a message very related to hope and happiness if you believe that certain things are possible for you they will happen as if by magic yeah so don't give up on that belief because with your own belief and making sure that you're always walking in the direction of your dreams they will happen for you a lot of miracles are going to be expected for you in your future is what is coming forth as i told you your faith was being tested in lot of ways now financially as well i feel like the gates of abundance are opening up for you it's going to be like you know everything that you waited for for so long everything that you held on to for so long it's going to happen for you yeah abundance is destined when it comes to you see right now what is happening you know you've planted the seeds and you continue to plant the seeds in the beautiful way but it is almost like you know even though the soil is very fertile the rain needs to happen and for the rains to come in there is a little bit of time and once the rains are in place everything will be fine that is the message i'm getting through because you are doing your job beautifully see sometimes what happens is you know we could be giving our 100% or 110% but if the situations around us especially planetary are not favorable we can knock our head against the wall 100 times but it doesn't happen and the minute things shift it is like voila you get what you want okay that's what is happening in your case frustrating i know i've been there done that and i can tell you all you want to have patience but i know how difficult it is so i'm going to be include oh my god including you in my prayers that was the message have patience and remember to be kind always see sometimes what happens is you know when we are going through normal situations kindness is very easy but it is when things get difficult sometimes you know the people become tough or they are filled with despair when it comes to certain things so don't allow that to happen when it comes to you always remain patient and kind and know that when it is your time you will get whatever it is that you need yeah patience is what is needed on your part and of course patience is always difficult once again you know it's like miraculously things will happen around you in fact the way i see this you know for you especially with the first two cards it is already happening yeah you just have to witness things you can see like okay this is what i wanted i'm i've already gotten it i was thinking who can i approach for help but i meet this person and this person has helped me out see people are placed in your life by magic and that is the blessing that divine has bestowed on you pile to is what archangel michael is here to tell you however in your case what is happening you know you are almost becoming your biggest enemy because you are trapping yourself yeah now the trap is almost a sense of resentment see when certain things don't come to us at a particular time we are like okay you know god hates me everybody hates me why do things always happen to me so this is not exactly resentment towards somebody in particular this is almost resentment towards your fortune see we always are like you know why did god write my destiny this way but wait for the next chapter that is what the message is coming through okay so free yourself from these limiting beliefs is the message coming through for you and once again you know you have to find your strength and you have to find your faith right now i feel like those two things may be sort of dicey when it comes to you so please hold on to your faith because your faith will move mountains for you and will bring you things that almost seem very very difficult that is the nature of faith yeah the things that are not written in your destiny they will come to that is what i'm really picking up faith let's see i'm going to give you messages from archangel michael when it comes to your you know career for other areas of your life now when it comes to you, you know your dealings or relationship with an older woman are going to be very important and this person will play a significant part in your life 
okay a change for the better as i was sensing so whatever is happening you know as i told you you are at the peak of karma resolving certain karma yeah because once you resolve that karma things will get so much better keep your life in balance so once again you know don't sort of tilt towards one side be even minded when it comes to everything because it is that even minded this that will get you everything you want yeah so don't listen to anybody blindly is what is coming through the most difficult part of the situation is over and i'll tell you you know if you are the kind of people who've held on through difficulties then it's like you know it's like game over everything is fine you are out of troubled waters a short journey a trip is likely for you in uh, some time of course is what i'm getting through of course this was a message in my previous reading as well so yeah, a journey seems to be likely when it comes to you you know you are on the road to success but the road itself seems tough i don't know what it is that you're doing but you're walking on a difficult terrain but you are on the right road so you will succeed eventually that's the message coming through now however one thing that you need to be aware of is pride because see everything is fine but if you are going to be having that sense of pride then it's almost like i wish this was not there yeah once again the peacock spirit shining through so beware of that pride is a message for you uh, excitement so i feel like something exciting is going to be happening when it comes to your life a wish is going to be granted so the thing is you know when you resolve this most difficult part it's like what you've always wanted it's like so close very very close okay so don't you quit at all yeah as i told you you know you've done your job now it's like the rains have to come in oh marriage as well uh, now for a couple of you there is a possibility that somebody may get married this can be you or this could be somebody else in your family so that may also happen doing something risky and taking a chance so if you are like uh, should i do this is this risky see unless you do something risky you always going to be safe and in safety nobody has found anything different yeah that is what is coming through when it comes to you guys overall these are the messages for you from archangel michael and as i wrap this up i'm going to leave you with my best wishes i will see you next time bye hello and if you selected pile 3 then these are the messages that you need to receive from archangel michael let's take a look okay when it comes to you guys pile 3 remember that whatever you're going through right now you're going to survive this and not only are you going to survive this you are in fact going to be thriving in fact whatever is happening in your life you know it will open your eyes to new possibilities to a new world entirely so whatever is happening you know for you it's almost like a blessing in disguise it may seem difficult to understand right now but you'll know why these things happened of course the next couple of weeks also marks the period of a new beginning in your life okay now this can be multiple area simultaneously is what is coming through remember pal 3 you have a double mission on planet earth one is of course to be whoever you want to be when it comes to your work in your relationship but you also a star seed you are a light worker so in some capacity you will serve the world yeah and serving the world is not just being a social worker or it's not just about being a tarot reader it's about just being a good person a helpful person and i feel like that is the role that you will play in this lifetime you'll impact the lives of multiple people is also what is coming through now remember this there is going to be a breakthrough of some sorts yeah especially when you felt like okay i'm really stuck here and there's no way to go out from here you're going to be finding a breakthrough yeah and that breakthrough will almost release you from a lot of things that is what i'm saying it's like free at last and it's like you are pure once again in a sense you know your energy is like that of a baby once again interestingly you've also picked the opal yeah so that's the energy that is coming through now remember this in the upcoming time i sense you know lot of new beginnings happening for you there also going to be important doors opening and when important doors open for you you just have to walk through them and believe that wherever this door leads it's going to be good for me 
सो डोंट डाउट और सेकेंड गेस योर सेल्फ वेन इट कम्स टू सर्टन थिंग्स आई फील लाइक मूवमेंट इज नेसरी फॉर यू इट्स लाइक दिस पार्ट ऑफ योर स्टोरी इज ओवर वे यू आर राइट नाउ दैट स्टोरी इज ओवर एंड इट्स लाइक यू नो द अपग्रेडेड स्टेज फॉर यू बिगिन्स नाउ lot of wishes are going to come true for you okay that's also something that i'm really hearing now there's a message about your third eye so for some of you you know getting inspired dreams getting inspired ideas your intuition being really really highlighted is possible certain dreams are also possible when it comes to a couple of you okay but your third eye is really really highlighted out here and okay now when it comes to you you know your connections with your ancestors are going to be very important now this could be you know doing some kind of ritual for your ancestors like praying for them every single day lighting a candle in their honor because i feel like for the next stage of your journey your ancestors will be really really helpful for you in terms of giving you the guidance and support that you need now okay you also being healed from your past and when you step into this future you're going to be stepping in as a new person you're not going to be stepping in with your old stories because i feel like you're getting rid of it in certain ways which is why i'm sensing movement purity once again but in the future you're going to be having a greater amount of clarity when it comes to your life now one thing you need to remember is you need to turn on the light of your heart when you look at anybody you look at any person don't look at them with judgment look at them with kindness because when you look at a person with kindness okay i feel like you are almost god like yourself you're very pure yourself and that is the stage at which you're reaching and please remember this you know one way to heal yourself is to go back to a time when you felt love because sometimes the places that you we have been hurt it's been there because of a lack of love so if if somebody is hurt your feelings especially your romantic partner go back to a time where they treated you right and in that moment forgive them and release them yeah that's going to be very important that way you know you'll free yourself is what is coming through and okay now not only are you going to be having purity within yourself as a result of that purity your relationships will become better too there is going to be harmony when it comes to your family yeah new chapters in your family is also coming through now when it comes to your life you have to remember you have to be courage you have to not only be courage but you also have to sort of show up with courage when it comes to certain things so now it is a time to not rely on any external power but to rely on the power of your soul to rely on the power of that soul that is so strong and so powerful and you will be shown the way that is coming through yeah one thing however you need to remember is you have to protect yourself protect yourself from negative energies so you can do that by chanting a mantra constantly and to make sure that you protect your thoughts i'm specifically getting a message of protecting your thoughts okay now of course you can use some kind of crystal with you or prayer is like much more better yeah prayer is very very protective so use that i'm going to be giving you messages from archangel michael from your tea leaf cards now when it comes to you pile 3 dealing or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair is going to be important now once again remember this this person is placed in your life by archangel michael in a way to protect you and to show you the steps forward yeah that's coming through okay now protect it from negative forces beyond your control once again you had the message of protect yourself in a way you know this person this can be like a guide or this person can just be a helpful friend is also involved very very actively in protecting you from negative forces yeah advice from a friend so there is a possibility you're going to be getting some kind of advice from a friend and this friend always comes with good advice in your case is coming through karma you will reap what you've sown so basically what has happened for you you know you've paid the price for the bad karma and i feel like that has been a part of the first three cards when it comes to your reading but it's like you know it's it's almost time it's almost time that's the message i'm getting here and i'll tell you by the time april comes in i feel like you'll be out of this phase for a couple of you you are already out by the time you know it's the 17th or the 18th 
because once again it's the saturn the movement is happening here so once again now it's time for the good karma to come in your direction stepping into something new as i was telling you here there's going to be a lot newer that you're going to be experiencing so don't be afraid is a message coming through for you guys as well yeah light-hearted carefree time so i feel like now you're really going to be experiencing the light energies yeah i feel like things were really heavy around here and it's almost like it's going to be a flip and you will experience positivity once again you will experience that light-heartedness once again and i feel like you know i feel like this person had a lot to do with it behind the scenes because you were protected from negative forces and uh, however you need to make sure to pay attention to your health so once again please make sure you're eating right you're sleeping well and you're just taking care of yourself okay that's supremely important you will be shown the way so the thing is when it comes to your life you know you're always shown the way it's like do this if you do this you are saved that is what is really coming through when it comes to you hard work ahead so remember this when you're stepping into this new experiences especially on a spiritual level you know on the next level you're supposed to be putting in extra work that's coming through and of course this could be applied to your work as well so if you have something important coming up like an examination or a promotion due please make sure you work hard and work hard consistently opportunities are waiting for you so yes lot of new doors are opening lot of new doors are opening doors that were previously closed birth or conception of a child or enterprise so for a couple of you this could be like you may start a new business or this could be you know a new child coming in of course for a couple of you you know we treat our projects like our babies so that may be possible for a baby as well you know a pet and once again whatever it is that you do i feel like in the upcoming time you'll do it with great passion and when anything is done with great passion it yields fruit the darkness is on its way out you know as i told you for some of you you're already on your way out if you're feeling lighter than you have before and by the time april comes in i feel like you'll feel so much better yeah but overall that is what is coming through when it comes to your life and as always as i wrap this up i'm going to leave you with my best wishes i will see you next time